In this video, I'm going to show you how you can delete a playlist and also show you how you can create one. So the questions have come in saying, how do I create a playlist? How do I delete a, a playlist? So I'm going to be showing you how you can do that in this video. So the first thing you want to do is log into your YouTube channel, obviously. And then you click on your picture or your image. You have my channel creator studio. So I'm not going to click on this creator studio here because I want you to just see your dashboard. So I'm going to click on my channel so you can see your dashboard. So now that you have your dashboard, you've got creator studio and you have customize channel. So I'm going to click on customize channel okay so here we have customized channel we're going to click on playlist So here we have our playlist. You see how to videos and you know all the video and playlists that I have here. Now I'm going to click on the title of the playlist. So if I want to delete this playlist, I do not want to delete it, but if I wanted to delete this playlist, I'm going to click on edit. And you see, there's nothing here that shows you how to delete it. But if you move your console, just watch, you'll find three dots. You click on those dots, it says delete playlist. Yeah, so this is how you delete your playlist. Well, I don't want to delete this one, I'm just showing you how you delete your playlist. Okay, okay, so a second way to find your playlist is click on your image, creator studio. So, you know, the first time I said don't touch creator studio you just go to my channel but now you click on creator studio okay when you click on creator studio it's going to show you video manager on your left hand side you click on that and you see videos all your videos will come up and then you see playlist you click on playlist so you can see that we have more playlists appearing now in the first option when we did the first bit we didn't see this playlist that has no videos in it we the, we saw these ones but we didn't see the ones that didn't have any videos so when you go to video manager and you do playlists, you tend to see everything that you have. So everything I have, all my playlists is here. So I would like to remove this because I do not have any video in it. And I don't want to keep it because I have two how to video, um, how to videos playlists. And I don't want to keep both of them. This is empty anyway. So what I'm going to do is click on edit playlist. It's going to open up you click on edit again and it's going to open up and you see the three dots you click on those three dots delete playlist and it says are you sure you want to delete how to videos yes I would love to delete it you click yes and there it goes And that's gone now. 
okay so we're going to do the same thing again because you can see it doesn't show me all of my playlists i know i still have some that has no video in it that i would like to delete okay and it's not on my safe playlist i haven't got anything there except these two so i'm going to do creator studio again yeah and i'm going to video manager and you have playlist so you click on playlist So that the, the, the one that had no video is, is not there anymore, is gone. I'm going to scroll down and see if I have any more without, you can see, I have two others that have no videos in them and I want them out. I don't want to keep them. So I'm going to do edit playlist again. Edit again. Unfortunately, you have a lot of click, click, click. And then remember to have your console go all the way to the corner. You see the three dot dot, click on it. Delete. Yes, I would love to delete it. Delete. And that's gone. Okay. And now I'd, I can't find the other empty one again. I can't find the em other empty ones. All the ones I have here have videos in them. And so the only way to find the other empty one is to click on my image, click on Creator Studio. Maybe there's another way, but this is the way I have found that that takes me to what I'm looking for. And then go to Video Manager. playlist yeah playlist i'm going to scroll down and see if i see an empty one so that's empty one but let me scroll down and see if i have another empty one because i thought i had just three so of course there's another one so there's one called the love on box book project that's empty there's a periscope one that is empty so that needs to go uh let me see if there's any other oh there's another oh there are two other ones that need to go that are empty okay so without making this video too long i'm just going to delete those ones at my own time but now you know how to delete playlist if you want to delete them and then how do you add a new playlist you click right there at the top new you put the name of the playlist so what do we call it now let's call it um, uh, play, playlist removing playlist training yeah let's call it playlist training so we've called, play, called it playlist training we can choose if we want it to be public we can choose if we want it to be unlisted. We can choose it if we want it to be private. One thing you need to remember is if you're doing a collaborative playlist, um, you need to make it public. If you intend for your views to count, you make it public because YouTube changed their, their, their laws a few years back that it's only videos that are set to public that the views will be counted. So you send it to public if you want, if your intention is for the video or the playlist views to be counted, you set it to public. If your intention is just to use it for like a training, if you're doing a coaching program or in school and you want the videos to just be for your students and not for the public, you make it unlisted so that the link can be accessed by the community you want to share it with. And if you make it private, you are the only one who would see the playlist. Nobody else will see it, just you. So 
this is just for training i'm just gonna make it public and then i'm gonna delete it because um, i don't need it basically so i'm just going to do public so you can see create okay let's see if we have it now and it refreshes voila is there playlist training has been created and then if we want to add videos we can always add videos and you know how to add videos i have done that i have shown you how to add videos in another um training so check out on my webs on the channel on how you can add videos to a playlist i hope this training has helped and um, let me know if you have any questions i'll be happy to answer so thank you very much for watching and i will see you on the next training video take care bye